Welcome to another edition of the most consistent... No, you know, you know what? No, I'm, I'm not even going to go that route today because I'm, I'm not about Sean's View Entertainment today. I'm not coming to you as SVE. I'm not coming to you with my view and my opinion of rumors and news and headlines and previews and predictions and commentaries and vlogs. No, no, today I'm simply coming to you as Sean. I'm coming to you as a man that you would see in the movies, a, a man that you would see in the mall, a man that you would see walking down the street. I'm coming to you as Sean. I'm coming to you as Sean Patrick today. And what, I, what me and my girlfriend have, have had to endure over the last 24 hours and having to relive the incident uh, that went down where someone, burglars, tried to break and enter, tried to invade my privacy, tried to come into the confines of me and my girlfriend's apartment is completely sick. It's, it's twisted and it's wrong on every single level. No matter what their plan, no matter what their action, no matter what they wanted to accomplish and no matter what they wanted to do. That could have ended up being a very horrible situation. It's one thing to harass and bully someone online and call them names. It's one thing to do that, and that's bad, and that's horrible. That has led to many people killing themselves. But I've tried to ignore that. Tried to let it go in one ear and out the other. I tried to listen to the subscribers. I tried to hear the viewers. I tried to listen to the voice of reason. And I tried to go about my business and doing what I love and doing what I'm passionate about. And that's talking WWE and giving all the updates of WWE backstage news, rumors, headlines, commentaries, previews, predictions, breaking news. Anything that revolves or resolves around WWE, I bring it to you because that's what this channel has been built upon. But for one reason, things got out of hand. Like I said, I can... Try to ignore the hate and the death threats. I can try to ignore all of that. But when that stuff comes to my front door and it tries to break into where I am living my life, that's when, that's, that's when you, 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 there's no turning back. And, uh, you know, me and my girlfriend have been thinking over the last 24 hours since this incident occurred. And um, it's, it's taken its toll. Um, you know, the death threats and the harassment... You know, that's one thing that, you know, any celebrity or any person that's a top YouTuber has to deal with. When you're in the public eye, that's that's what you have to do. But I'm, I'm not I'm not famous. I'm not well known. I'm not popular. OK, so if I have this kind of hate and death threats and harassment, if I have these people coming to my front door trying to force entry and I'm not even I'm not even at sixty one thousand subscribers yet. Can you imagine the level of intensity it's going to be? Can you imagine how worse it's going to be when I reach 100,000 subscribers? Or God forbid if I ever reached a million subscribers one day. I'm, well, but me, well, you know what? Then maybe by that time I'll have the money to pay uh, security, to pay a cop, to pay an officer, to get better locks, to get better security uh, you know, around my house, around my, around my apartment. I just never thought the hate would get so much to the point where someone would want to come to my house and confront me or maybe even kill me or hurt me or my family. You know, a lot of people say, I live with my mother. I don't live with my mother. I live with my girlfriend. I have, I'm in an apartment, second floor. And, uh, you know, it's, it's, it's unreal. It's actually unbelievable. I never in my life have ever been, uh, a, I've never had someone try to break into my house, never had someone try to force entry um, I, I've never had to deal with that kind of stuff. You know, before YouTube.com, my life was a lot less stressful. But I am willing to deal with this because this is what I love. I am not good at college. I don't want to go to college. I, I've tried different jobs. I've tried a variety of different jobs over the, over the tenure of my life ever since I left high school in 2007. It just didn't work out. It wasn't for me. I found what I'm good at on YouTube.com. I found what I'm passionate about, and that's talking WWE. And for one reason or another, people just don't want to see me to be. They don't want to see me branch out. They don't want to see me become successful. They want to stop me at every single direction. And I, I have, you know, I know I came on here a few weeks ago saying about, you know, I was thinking about quitting YouTube because the harassing and the bullying was getting to be too much. But then the subscribers and viewers, with their overwhelming, uh, you know, response and your message and your comments, willed me on. The support that I got was absolutely awesome. And once again, there's a lot of critics. There's a lot of haters. There's a lot of people that are talking negative about this incident, saying that it was a storyline and that it didn't happen. Listen, if you don't believe it didn't happen, you don't have to believe it. I'm not coming on here with a gun to your head and saying you have to believe this. If you don't believe it, fine. 
The bottom line is I know what happened. I know what existed. I know what the, the events that went down between 5 and 6 o'clock in the morning. So does my girlfriend. We all know what happened. We all, want, we all know what transpired. The biggest story here is should I continue on YouTube.com? Should I continue with the level of threat, with the intensity of the action that is happening? With what I am going through, this, this is also being... Remember this, I'm still getting death threats, but I'm just not addressing it. I'm still getting bully, bullied, but I'm not addressing it. I'm trying to stick to what you want. You want content, you want uploads, you want WWE talk, and I'm trying to give you that, but there's all these other uh, things that are getting in my way. There's all these other, what's the word I'm looking for right now? There's all these other, um, uh, I, I, you know, to tell you the truth, I can't even, you know, this this is the thing. This is when you know I'm shooken up. This is when you know I, you know... <sighs> I, I don't know. I don't know what to do, okay? I, I, I'm, I'm a rock in a hard place here. I love YouTube. I want to continue YouTube. I love my subscribers. I don't want to leave my subscribers behind. This is my job. This is my income. This is the only thing that I have. This is what I live for. This is what I get up for every single day. But I have all these obstacles. I have all these detours. And listen, I'm not perfect. I, I, I'm, I'm not the Virgin Mary. I, I, I'm not an angel. I've done wrong. I've done my mistakes. I've owned up to it. I've been a man. And, and, and people still want to go on the past. People still want to be history teachers. People want to bring it to the level of coming to my front door. And like I said, week after week, obstacle after obstacle. I love this. This is what I love. This is what I love. This is what I love. And damn it, I don't want to stop. I don't want to go away. But I might be forced to do something that I don't, I don't want to do. I might be forced to having to quit YouTube and leave my channel and delete it. I, I may be forced, I, my hand is being forced here. When it gets to this level, you know, if I had the money, if I had the, the kind of subscribers, the kind of viewers, if I made good money on here, sure, I, I'd get more security, I'd get more locks, I'd, I, I had, I, I'd hire security guards. I don't have that kind of money, okay? I'm just like you, I'm just like anybody else out there. Uh, I, I'm, I'm living life, I'm doing what I can do, and I'm surviving. I'm not thriving, but I'm surviving. And every day, as long as you're above ground, is a good day. But, I, I, you know, I, I love WWE. I love coming on here. I, I love doing this. This is what I love to do. But when, when, when it gets to be this bad and this heated, you know, people said, well, quit YouTube. Take a break. Uh, you know, just lay low. You're in the public eye, so you should expect this. No. When you're at almost 60,000 subscribers, you should, you should not expect someone to try to break into your house. That, 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 that is the lowest of lows, okay? That, that means you have no life. You have no goals. You, 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 you. My goal is to be the best on YouTube.com. My plan is to go above and beyond the call of duty on YouTube.com, all right? I mean, my plan is to do what I can to survive. And that's what I'm doing right now is I'm surviving. But I have to have my eyes behind my head. I have to always be looking around, making sure that no one's going to be looking at me. No one's seen me. No one's trying to break in. You know, the, the level of threats on here is absolutely insurmountable. The, the, the level of threats, it's it's all-time lows. And we, we live in a crazy, crazy life. And you always have to look over your shoulder. You know, someone told me, go buy a gun. Well, I don't have a gun license. I don't have a permit. I can't just shoot somebody that comes onto my property. It's just, I don't have a gun. I don't, I don't have the rights to do that. But someone thinks that they have the rights to break and enter. Now, I don't know the situation. Like I said, I didn't notify the authorities. I don't know what's going on with that. I don't even know what's going on with me. I don't know what's going on with my YouTube channel. I want to continue this. I want to do this. I don't want to leave the subscribers and viewers behind, but I am being forced into a situation where I may have to quit, where, where I may have to go away, where I am doubting whether or not I should go out and get a part-time job. I don't want to work. I don't want to do anything else. This is what I want to do. This is my destination. This is my home. I have spent countless hours. I have spent countless years. I have spent countless weeks and months building this channel and bringing it out and expanding it. But for a few select people out there, whether it be online or in person, want to ruin it. I don't know. I, I don't know. I'm not going to tell you to unsubscribe. I'm going to tell you to stay subscribed. But I just don't know what I'm going to do. I have to think long and hard. I don't know what I'm going to do. I'm going to take the next couple of days uh, to think. Um, I'm going to talk it over with my girlfriend. Uh, see what we, we can do. But this is getting to an all-time low. This is getting to sick levels now. I'll, I'll update you. Don't unsubscribe. And please just thank you for the comments and thank you for the opinions. I love you all. I'll, I'll be back. I just, I just got to reevaluate everything. Subscribe.